Hi everyone, welcome back to Trini Kids TV. And if you're here for the first time, welcome to Trini Kids TV. My name is Auntie Shade, and it's so nice of you to join us. Now today, we are in a brand new week and we're ready to start circle time. So let's start our circle time by singing our good morning song. Let's sing the good morning song together, okay? Ready? Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. And a very good morning to all of our friends that are watching. Now, let's say the days of the week and the months of the year. But wait, do you know what day it is today? Yes, today is Monday. Monday comes after Sunday. Yesterday was Sunday and now today is Monday. Today is Monday, today is Monday. All day long, all day long. So let's say the days of the week. The days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Right. Right, everyone. And can you remember what month we are in? Yes, we are still in the month of January. And we're coming close to the end of January. Let's find out about the weather. And to find out about the weather, of course, we need to sing our weather song. So let's get ready to sing our weather song. All right, are you ready? Well, let's go. What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today, today? What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today? Well, is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Well, friends, we can look out our windows and see what kind of weather we are having today. Well, take a look. Yes, today is a cloudy day. All right. And we all know what a cloudy day means, right? It means that the clouds are just blocking the sun. So, a cloudy day is still a nice day to have fun outside. Alright, so I hope, my friends, that you go and get a chance to play outside and get some fresh air because we know exercise and fresh air is very important, right? Now, let's find out what our color of the day is. Now, our color of the day is the color yellow. Can you think of something that might be yellow? Yes, the sun is yellow. Lots of things are yellow, right? Now, let's talk about our shape of the day. Our shape of the day is a cube. Take a look at that cube. Now, let's talk about our number of the day. Our number of the day today is the number 10. And guess what? You have 10 fingers and 10 toes. So maybe we could count while we use our fingers. Are you ready? Well, let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, nine and ten great job everyone can you 
wiggle those fingers wiggle them all around there are lots of things you can do with your hands right we can clap we can snap we can wave to our friends hello and goodbye yes we can do lots of things with our hands right and now let's find out about our letter of the day now can you remember what letter we stopped at on friday yes we stopped at the letter b so next is the letter c yes c is our letter of the day can you think of words that start with the letter of the day yes c for cat c a t cat yes so cat begins with the letter c now let's talk about our area of the day but before we talk about our area of the day let's jump in our boat and sail to trinidad our area of the day today is carony and what do we know about carony carony swamp and that is a tourist attraction mainly because there are lots of birds there are lots of wildlife natural trees and all of those things that you can take a look at and you can also have nice tours on the Karani Swamp. And one important thing, you can see our national bird, the Scarlet Ibis in the Karani Swamp. It's the home of the Scarlet Ibis. So if you really want to see a Scarlet Ibis up close, you can take a trip to the Karani Swamp, all right? Now, it's time for our lesson for today. And do you know this week we are going to be talking about something really interesting, right? This week we are going to be talking about heroes. I know you heard that word before, but do you know what a hero is? Yes, some of you might be thinking of your favorite characters. Maybe it might be Superman or Batman or Paw Patrol. So being a hero could be something like you do something really brave for someone or you help someone in need. That's what being a hero is. And this week we are going to explore some of the heroes of Trinidad and Tobago. All right. And I'm sure that could be really, really fun. Now, I wonder what kind of hero I could be. Maybe we can imagine what kind of hero we might be if we were to be a hero, right? Well, I wonder what I would dress up like if I were a superhero. Hmm. I would have a super cape and a, a super mask. Ha! And I'll be a superhero and fight crime. I wonder what kind of superhero you would be. So my friends, now that we learned something about our heroes, we can do a drawing of what our hero might look like. You can use your imagination and think of what, what your hero might look like. Maybe you can draw yourself as a superhero. What kind of hero would you be? What kind of costume would you wear? What colors would you use? All right, so I want you to take your time and get your paper and your crayons. You can even use paint, whatever you like to draw your hero. All right, so go ahead and draw your hero and have lots of fun. Now, I know you enjoyed today's episode and I can't wait for us to talk more about our superheroes. All right, so join me here tomorrow where we're going to talk a lot more about the different heroes in Trinidad and Tobago. I'll see you next time, friends. Bye.